Someone just found a dragon skeleton, and scientists don't have an answer. The dragon has been a myth and legend for thousands of years, and people believed it was just an old folk tale. However, a week ago, someone found something the world will never forget. Robert Matthew, a professor and paleontologist who graduated from Yale University, gave a short lecture about a theory he called the Draco Theory, in which he believed dragons could exist as in the past. Many huge bird species, such as the Argentavis, went extinct without any parent cause. However, many fossils were found with huge bite marks that couldn't be traced to any any other animal. However, other paleontologists said this theory was ridiculous and that it wasn't possible. However, Robert would soon prove everyone wrong. Robert started by going to a site where he knew one of these large birds was discovered with bite marks and started looking around for any signs of a dragon or a larger creature. Then, after little effort, Robert spotted something extraordinary. He saw a huge claw in the dirt. It was at least six inches long and was in perfect condition, suggesting it wasn't very old. Robert began to dig around the area of where he found this claw, and less than an hour later, he found something that made 